Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what Spirit wants you to hear. Please remember this may not resonate for everyone. So let's go straight into this and find out what Spirit wants you to know. Okay, so I am getting that you may meet somebody, okay, um, that seems to be really friendly, you seem to really get along with them, okay. The problem with this person, whoever this person is, now they seem to be somebody that comes off um, very strong, okay, very likeable, okay, very strong personality, um, this person seems to stand out, um, I'm hearing red flag, okay, now I do see this person being very friendly, um, also like offering to maybe pay for things, okay, definitely somebody that gives off a very, um, dominant vibe, okay, somebody that gives off a very powerful vibe, somebody that seems to, um, definitely have their way with communication, they're able to communicate their way through things, okay, they're able to basically make friends with anybody, befriend anybody, um, I do see this person being very outgoing, also very attractive, I'm hearing extrovert, okay? I do see that this person is very out there, okay? They have no problem coming up and initiating a conversation. Um, I do see that you may form a friendship with this person very quickly. Um, yeah, this is like meeting somebody and this is like a very strong connection. I do see this being... Um, a very, like, a good friendship, right? Somebody that comes off to be very genuine. Um, somebody that comes off to be a great friend, okay? You may meet them at work. The thing is about this person, though, right? Um, you may feel a very strong connection to them. The thing is, they seem to... It's like they're going to pull you off path, I'm hearing, okay? This person may be... I'm hearing take you off track, okay? Again, you may feel a very strong connection to this person. Um, they also may... I am getting that this person, they, they seem to, like, have a lot in common with you. Again, strong connection, okay? That in, like, an instant connection, you guys get along really well. I do feel this person, like... There's, like, a karmic scent to this person, okay? I do see that this person trying to sort of... Now, not straight away, but if you do entertain whoever this is, right? Um, this person is going to take you off track, right? I do see this person sort of blocking your intuition, I'm hearing, okay? Um, encouraging you to do... Things that put you on a low vibration that take you away from your actual soul purpose, right? I, I'm hearing tempting. Like, I do think that this person will tempt you to, like, do things, okay, um, that you usually wouldn't do. They're also going to tempt you to, um, again, sort of pull away from what you're meant to be doing, okay? This is like coming in as a distraction, to be honest. This person going to distract you from your soul purpose. For some of you, this is like a new connection coming in, okay? Again, you're going to feel a strong connection to this person. Um, or this could be somebody that you haven't heard from in a while. So this could be somebody that um, you, for example, like a childhood friend or something, or somebody that you may have had a falling out with, right, and they're coming back into your life, I do see this person sort of holding you back though, okay, 
um, coming in between your, your soul purpose and where you're meant to be and sort of just causing conflict here, okay? This person's like a catalyst, okay, for a roadblock or a catalyst um, sort of trying to take you off your path here. I just seen 515. Um, again, they're going to come off really friendly, okay? Um, they're going to gain your trust. You could be dealing with a Virgo. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Scorpio here. I'm hearing Andrew. Again, um, this person going to try to gain your trust to get into your energy or get back into your energy. Um, for some of you, this is somebody that's already proven, like, they've already proven that they're sort of somebody that's low vibration or somebody that you, that, that doesn't agree with you or there's something toxic about this person if you know them, okay? For some of you, you're just about to meet this person, okay? And this is like a distraction coming in trying to take you off path, right? Sort of this person going to come in and encourage you to do things. I'm hearing block your third eye, okay? Put you on a low vibration, okay? This person going to lead you into like, I'm hearing the loss of, okay? So like, it's like they're going to lead you into places that you don't need, they're going to give you stress that you don't need, they're going to take you off path, okay, again, I do see that, it's very hard to get into your circle, I'm hearing, okay, because you are very protected, you're also very spiritual, and you are very intuitive, the thing is about this person is they're going to really try to gain your trust here, and it's like they're going to, it's like, it's like a build up, right, to gain your trust, um, but this person's going to cause you confusion, to be honest, right? Again, they're trying to take you off path, right? Cause you confusion. Especially if you're doing really well in life right now. Um, you're about to, with the Ten of Pentacles here, you're literally about to, I'm hearing golden opportunity, like there's a golden opportunity that's going to bring, Wow. I didn't even see, like, Ten of Pentacles next to the Ten of Cups. There's something here. Oh, and we have the, the Hierophant. For some of you, this could be marriage. For others, this is something, this is, like, something that's going to make you very happy, okay? I'm hearing powerful, okay? Powerful relationship, I'm hearing powerful connection. So it's, like, something coming in before this a massive, two massive blessings come in, okay? One's money-related, the other is like, a relationship or something, I'm hearing true love, okay, the thing is, there's this, like, there's happiness here, but there is this test coming in, okay, somebody coming in to try to take you off path, yeah, sort of cause you unnecessary stress, twist your judgment, basically, okay, um, take you off path, I'm hearing energy vampire, okay, um, if you do connect with this person, you know, they may, like, literally suck the life out of you and you may have no energy, you may feel things going back with this person. Again, they're going to come in, and this person's going to very much overwhelm you with love, okay, when you first meet them, they may buy you things, okay, this person's going to come in heavy, and really try, now they also have a very genuine vibe to them for some reason, even though they seem, it, it, this person may be genuine, but they're coming in as a catalyst to take you off path, right, just before this blessing comes in, right, they may not even know that what their job is, they have a very karmic energy, okay, you may have had a past life with this person, I'm hearing multiple past lives, alive with this person where it's like the same thing happened so it's like a test coming in right 
I'm hearing a roadblock, okay? Again, they go, it's going to feel very genuine, the love that they're giving. They're going to feel very genuine, okay? Somebody that doesn't seem to have any hidden agenda, and they might not in the 3D, like in their like conscious mind. But it's like, this is a cycle that's ongoing, right? This person's a catalyst, okay? A roadblock here. This person is trying to get you back. Now, I do see whoever I'm speaking to. Um, you are very intuitive, very spiritual, and they're trying to get you back to the 3D. They're trying to get you to fall back into old habits, I'm hearing, okay? This person, I mean, I know it's a person, but again, they may not be conscious of what they're actually doing, but they're coming in to take you off path, to, it's like fog your judgment, that's what I'm hearing, fog your judgment, okay, you're going to be confused, okay, they're trying to drag you back into the 3D here, okay, they want you back in your ego, I am getting, whoever I'm speaking to, you've had this, like, you've already done this, like, you've had the ego death, you know, you're very spiritual, and I do see that this person coming in and this is like a temptation, okay? But also like a test, okay? So just be very, um, because this person wants you to let down your guard. Again, maybe not conscious, okay? Like I'm not getting this person coming in and being like, you know what? I want this person to get off their life path, you know? I'm getting that this is something that's karmic from past life. This person's done this before. It's a test coming in, okay? Um, a catalyst, basically, right? So they want you to let down your guard, okay? okay? Um, and they want you to basically, like, it's like they're going to try to gain your trust. Now I am getting that you're very guarded with your energy, but thing is they're going to try to bring down your wall, right? I just need one, two, two, two. Yeah, just before this new opportunity comes in, okay, this is like a test. There is a strong need to keep your energy guarded, okay, to keep your walls up, to keep... Just remember, okay, what you're focused on, right? Because... Again, this person is coming in and this is like them trying to drag you back to the 3D, drag you back to your ego to take you off path here, okay? Yeah, because they, it's not that like they want you to walk away, okay? But something that attached to them, there's like a negative attachment, okay? There's like some type of karma from a past life, okay, but they're going to come in, try to take you off your, take, put you on the wrong path, right, get you on your weak spot, they are going to come in, okay, um, and try to gain your trust, beware of that, okay, you could be dealing with a Python, beware of that, okay, just stay true to what you know, because this person trying to take your blessings away from you, whatever you've gained, okay, they're trying to drag you back into the 3D. They're trying to literally come in and make you stuck, right? Make you stuck, make you walk away from everything that's making you happy, everything that's going good in your life. I do see that there's confusion. It's just like I'm picturing a lot of dark mode. Again, they're going to come on very loving, okay? Somebody that seems to be very loyal, trustworthy, okay? No, this, this person's selfish, okay? Just a moment. This person coming in, trying to cause confusion, trying to stop this abundance coming in, trying to stop this happiness coming in, okay? This person, the energy vampire, okay, that wants to... Literally stop your blessings here, okay? 
they're coming in to disturb your energy. Make sure that you're very guarded with your energy at the moment. Do not let your walls down, I'm hearing. Yeah, because this person coming, they're coming for you. They're coming for your... Because they see that you're very guarded and they're coming for the wall that you have up and they want to gain your trust, okay? So make sure that you're focused on yourself at the moment, okay? Because this person literally coming in with nothing but trying to take you off your path and causing confusion, okay? This is like a test. And the thing is, this person trying to like drag you down and suck your energy and you know, put you in situations that aren't needed, cause stress here, take you off your path, put you back into your ego, right? That's all I have for you. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.